But you guys got another video here for you. Now I wanted to show you a way to detect whether CCleaner is on your system and how to silently remove it using PowerShell. And this has been uh, done by uh, Mike Frobbins and I'll uh, leave the link for his site in the uh, video description here. So I've got the code here which is what he's uh, made up here and basically you can just run these and it will detect whether CCleaner is on your system and also it will allow you to uh, silently remove it using uh, uh, PowerShell there. So let's go ahead and open up PowerShell. Now I have got a CCleaner on my system. So I'm just going to quickly run the first command here and this will detect whether we have got it on there and you can see it has found uh, the actual program on there. So all we need to do next is do your second command which is this one here and I'll just copy that and drop that down there and we can paste that in there and push enter and this should remove CCleaner from the system. Now what you can do once this has been removed is run the first command again to see whether it has been completely removed from your computer. So let's go ahead and copy that other command again. You can see now that's uh, gone back here so I'm just going to quickly paste this back in and you can see it has been uh, removed already. Very quick and easy to do and uh, we can have a look inside control panel. And open up control panel and you may be thinking yeah well you can just come inside here and just remove it and uninstall it uh, but it's a good way of doing things uh, PowerShell it's a good way to learn new things and uh, Mike Robbins has uh, put that up there for you to to use so it's always a good way to do stuff so you can see here it's now been removed uh, from my system anyway just a quick video I hope this one helps you out my name is Brian from brightechcomputers.co.uk thanks again for watching guys bye for now now if you haven't subscribed yet Hit the big red subscribe button on my YouTube channel and hit the bell notification button next to that to be notified when we upload new videos.